Let's have a look at Dynascape Color. Dynascape Color is a rendering tool that allows you to color render Dynascape drawings in three distinctive styles. Pencil crayon, marker hybrid, and contemporary. Let's have a brief look at these three styles. Pencil crayon gives you that hand-colored pencil crayon texture and feel. Marker hybrid is a blend of watercolor and magic markers. Contemporary is more of a graphic style with a less traditional look and feel. Let's have a look at how Dynascape Color works. Dynascape Color's user interface is simple and it's easy to understand. It basically contains our toolbar across the top, and on the side we have a place to choose our style, a place to choose our category of swatches, and the swatches for each of those categories is displayed below it. To insert a swatch into this design, all I need to do is choose my category. In this case, I'm going to color my trees first. So I'm going to go to my trees category, scroll through and find the swatch that I want to use. I want to use this swatch for this tree here. If I bring my mouse over top of that tree symbol, it will highlight if it's colorable. It will highlight blue. I left click, it will insert that swatch color into that symbol. Scroll down and choose my next uh, swatch for my tree and the last one over here. Then I'll go to my next category, choose the symbols that I want to use to color my shrubs, and just basically pick them, drop them on top. It goes very quickly. All the symbols that Dynascape has and all the libraries are all colorable, so you don't have to worry about setting them up. All I need to do is select the swatch that you want to use, drop it on top. Next category is perennials and grasses. I'll color up some grasses first. Then I'll move through and I'll start coloring some of my perennials, different colors. Then I'll go to my uh, rocks sw category of swatches, choose a rock swatch, insert that in. Scroll down, I'll go to my next category of uh, mulch and turf. Drop in a mulch or soil swatch for my plant bed. Then I'm going to choose a turf or grass swatch for my lawn area. Next I'll go to my paver category, choose a paver pattern for my walkway. Add a different color for the border. And last of all, I'm going to choose an asphalt swatch for my paved driveway. As you can see, Dynascape Color is easy to use. It's a simple interface, and it makes coloring fun.